I've been through the city, state, and federal databases. If this Devil's Breath lab does exist, it's off the books. The only other place I can think to look is in Norman's personal files. I've already been through his office computer. Are you thinking his penthouse? That building's full of Sable's men. If they spot me, other residents could get hurt in a firefight. I know, but I might be able to get in undetected. I can sneak in, find the lab's location, and get out. If anything goes wrong, I'll call you for backup. Okay. It's risky, but we need that location. Wait for me to get nearby, then make your move. I'll be ready. are warning that the mayor's sable agents, ostensibly here to protect us, are behaving more like an occupying army. But let's hear it from the caller. Go ahead. They won't let me in my building. Said it's quarantine. I said, fine, let me in and I'll stay there. They pointed their guns at me. I'll bring it to the attention of the proper authorities. Emergencies do not permit the suspension of human rights. Your elected officials may not be willing to fight for you, but J. Jonah Jameson is. Okay, MJ, I'm a couple blocks away. Let me know if you get into trouble. Thanks, Pete. Wish me luck. Okay. Norman's penthouse is on the top floor, but the elevator's on lockdown. Need to get into the security room to unlock it. He'll never survive this. Next election, he'll get destroyed. Maybe. I've seen Osborn survive worse. He is a cockroach. Yeah, that elevator goes straight to his penthouse. I'm sure he's up there right now. There's the security room. That guard will see me if I go in. Residents are pretty upset. Maybe I can rile them up to create a distraction. Why isn't Osborne down here? This sort of thing never happens to him. The mayor and his friends are exempt. Security let one of his biggest donors back upstairs right away. I knew it. It's all one big boys club. 
Come on. Ugh. Every second we stay down here, we risk catching that plague. Definitely stay away from the receptionist. Been coughing up a storm. What? They have to let us back upstairs. You can't treat us like animals. If I get sick, I'll sue you into the Off ground. Limits, ma'am. Left my stupid inhaler upstairs. I heard they'll let you up if you claim special circumstances. A health emergency might do it. Really? Come on, let's go talk to security. That should do it. Crap. Jerry, get out of here. We got a situation. Oh, man. I can't breathe. Let me back up. Security upstairs. room's open. Just need to get to the door without being seen. Everyone, please stay calm. Sable International has nearly finished their sweep. Hello. I know a few Sable agents who would love to meet you. I like this thing. Gotta turn him around. Might have something, Control. Stand by. Good boy. I'm sure Sable offers workman's comp elevator controls in the security room next to the Sable agent. Mary Jane Watson, super spy. Time to unlock that elevator. That did it. Norman's clearing out and the elevator's unlocked. Time to head upstairs. Penthouse elevator. This is it. Norman and Sable, right on cue. Find the alarm technician. Fire it. Useless button. Mm. <sighs> Norman's guards have all cleared out. If he's hiding something up here, I'm gonna find it. Warning. Fire doors engaged. Automated self-diagnostic commencing. Please remain calm. Doors are locked till the system check finishes. Scientific journals debating the Spider-Man problem. <laughs> so weird there's a whole cottage industry focused on explaining Pete's power. MJ, Sable presence downstairs just ballooned. I think Norman's being moved. Worried they might spot me. I might have had something to do with that. Keep your distance. I should be okay for now. What is this thing? Hmm. Schematics for a prototype combat mask. Looks like it can reveal structural weaknesses. Whoa, this mask is incredible. Is it showing a door hidden in that wall? I wonder where it leads. Hmm. 
Norman bids his the fabulous Osborne boys. Secret keypad behind the family portrait. Norman must like spy movies. We need to find the code for that keypad. Blueprint for the apartment. Tons of empty space right behind the wall with a family portrait. Who leaves space unused in a Manhattan apartment? Work order for a keypad lock. Looks like he used Harry's last day as the code. That must be the day Harry left for Europe. kept a journal. Maybe he recorded the date there. <sighs> Forgot about this. The Osbournes have a coat of arms and a motto. Pax in Bello. Peace in War. Harry said his mom used to cook all the time. You'd be surprised if Norman has ever even touched the stove. Norman locked up Harry's room. Wants it untouched for when Harry returns from Europe. But where did he put the key? City's in a state of emergency, but Norman still manages to get his laundry and cleaning done for him. <laughs> what a hero. Hey, Dad. On my way to Dr. Michaels for one last shot before the, um, the big trip. Um, uh, hey, if you're gonna meet me there, could you grab my journal from my room? I just wanted to record some thoughts on the big bon voyage day. God, Pete and I loved coming over here to watch movies when we were kids. A different world from Queens. <laughs> Funny how Harry always wanted the opposite. Nothing made him happier than watching cartoons on the little TV in May's kitchen. Wow, haven't heard Harry's voice in so long. He sounds so tired. Let's hope that journal is still here. Gotta check his room. Harry's room. But it's locked. I wonder where Norman keeps the key. be so carefree. I miss those days. Harry's mom, Emily. 
We used to make fun of him for calling her the prettiest mom at Midtown, but he might have been right. Score! This must be the key for Harry's room. What? This can't be for Harry, can it? Law books. Harry wants to be an environmental attorney, like his mom. Why didn't you tell us you were sick? Harry's journal. His last entry is marked July 18. That must be the code to that room. We should not rush off without a plan. We? You are staying here. The antiserum is ready, and I'm going to supervise production. You will be completely vulnerable without me. I seem to be completely vulnerable with you. I'm going alone. End of discussion. Keep Team 2 on standby. I'm getting some air. Pete, Norman's cure is ready. He's headed to the lab it's at now. Can you follow? Not without alerting him. Somebody spiked Sable's coffee today. Her men are set on double secret probation alert. Okay, then stay ready. I've almost got the location. Copy. Make it a sweep. status. Okay, 
July 18. Bingo. Spiders. Is Norman trying to reverse engineer Peter's abilities? The labels on these cages. Bioelectrokinesis. Optical camouflage. Norman Osborn. GR27 research log. The whole project has gone to hell. GR27 is a cure, not a disease. Wow. Norman wins the fancy map con. Looks like Norman's tracking Dr. Michael's movements. Creep fest. Huh. This shows all of Oscorp's properties. Had no idea they owned so Sable troop deployments. I bet I can find the Devil's Breath Lab with this. It must be an Oscorp property with a ton of Sable protection, frequented by Dr. Michaels. Dr. Michaels went to this Oscorp building, but there's no security detail. This can't be it. Good old Alpha Team. Nope, that's just a Sable patrol. None of these patrols cross Dr. Michael's path. Devil's Breath Lab must have a big Sable presence. GR27, that's the code name for Devil's Breath. This is it. Tenthan Cathedral. Isn't that... I knew it. Tenthan Cathedral, Oscorp's records department. Perfect place to hide a secret biotech facility. GR27 Martin Lee incident. What is this? And we are rolling. I will be right next door. Just relax and let the medicine do its work. created Lee. I, I have to get this. What? No! Who's there? We have a breach. High alert. Pete, I've got the lab location. And a lot more. How far away are you? Two avenues over. Say the word and I'm there. Great. Keep the motor running.
Need to clear that balcony. You are crazy. You're amazing. <laughs> 